Hello, I'm David Azer, and this is 3 Minute Ad Age, your daily video news show. Today we follow our noses to the Scent World Conference and Expo here in New York. It was the first international gathering specifically focused on the use of scent in marketing. It drew attendees from 20 countries, and it showcased an amazing array of technologies for dispensing, embedding, and transmitting smells in spaces as small as product packages and as large as sports stadiums. A keynote speaker was C. Russell Brumfield, who runs a scent marketing consultancy and is an author of the new book, Whiff. The wonderful thing about scent is that it's tattooed in the brain. T scent, scents are tattooed smells. They are dynamic. Once you smell during an, uh, a heightened experience, an adrenaline type of rush experience, this is where we all have memories. We smell something from when we were 12 years old. That was an emotional experience. So it tattoos on the brain. We reintroduced that. So you can do this in modern day with a brand by actually taking an exciting experience like a Rolling Stones concert. IBM, say they're the sponsor, and introduce a scent during a heightened emotion. And the science shows us that we can reintroduce that and get a little bit of that uh, psycho the psychological and physiological trigger on the shelf, on the market shelf. That's the key to branding now. It's endorphin branding. Mr. Brumfield and the Scent Marketing Institute that organized the conference now view fragrance delivery systems as a medium in its own right. We call the scent delivery systems the fragrance media. And that is just another set of media. First of all, fragrance is delivered in um, through environmental means, through inks and varnishes, touch release programs. Microencapsulation can be used in plastic and in rubber and in uh, embedded in a lot of products. That's the new things that are happening is embedded products. Um, I.e. Kumo tires out of Japan wanted to market towards ladies last year so they rolled out three different uh, lavender and uh, different like jasmine, three different scents in their tires here in the United States. Among the largest buyers of scent technology are hotels and retail chains according to Mr. Brumfield. Vegas uh, started implementing scent because of the 45 to 50 percent increase in slot machine usage about 10 years ago. Those wonderful research. So the, those hotels in Vegas and, and in New York and along the coast, that started it and now it's a nationwide chain stores. You go across uh, a, a, a Abercrombie and Fitch, um, you can name a lot of these uh, stores, The Gap. They're all either in the trials or they're already rolled out. And that's the people who have come to this conference are supplying those stores to the tune of several thousand new environments a month. And that's it for this 3-Minute Ad Age. Thanks for being with us. I'm David Azer at Advertising Age in New York.